All right, Libra. Libra, we're going to do a general read for you guys today, looking at your current energy, desires, outcome, what's working for you, what you need to be aware of. We'll clarify all those cards, and then we'll pull three cards at the end of everything just to make sure that we have covered off the information that you need to hear. Thank you for all of you for supporting my channel. Um, let's get started and see where your energies are. <clears throat> King of Swords. Somebody's very, being very thoughtful and definitive about what they're doing. Uh, justice shows up in your desires. So to be standing in your own energy. <clears throat> and the outcome is the Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles is information or messages regarding your employment. So some type of good financial news should be coming in for you. What you need to be aware of is the King of Cups. So uh, that energy around using your wisdom, being emotionally in control. And what you need to be aware of is the star card. So being aware of hopes, dreams, better times ahead, optimism, that type of thing. So let's go through, let's start to clarify. King of Swords, Empress, Eight of Pentacles, and the Four of Pentacles. So for some of you, It looks like there's a marriage or something um, with the Empress here that you've been working towards uh, and you're scared to lose for some reason. Um, this is kind of interesting because I'm really drawn to this justice at this particular point. And I feel that it is actually tied to this, that there is, for some of you, it might be a business that you don't want to lose, <clears throat> that you need to be very, very, you know, sort of thoughtful about what you're doing in this. It's kind of interesting. Um, but it's, it's you're being very thoughtful about a marriage, you're being very thoughtful about what you're doing for work. Um, and as you're doing that, you're also very thoughtful about what you could lose. <clears throat> Justice is your desire. So if I read this as standing in your own energy, uh, Part of it for some of you it is standing in your own energy because things have just been taken so long to materialize and change for you but it's finally happening and that's helping you to feel better about things plus there could be some type of romantic offer that could be coming in for you uh, if I read this as for some of you, this could be that there needs to be major balance in what's going on. Uh, you could be putting in a lot of energy into this and not getting the return that you want. <clears throat> so you're putting in a lot of energy into this uh, or a lot of work into this relationship and you're just not getting what you want out of it. And you're hoping that this will actually balance out, balance out to the point where things start to move and things start to go sort of more your way where there's somebody that's filling your cup rather than you just filling theirs. The Page of Pentacles. Uh, clarified by the Three of Cups, the Moon, and the Four of Cups. This is the... Sorry, the sun just went down and really made this dark. Uh, we're going to continue on rather than hopefully the camera will pick this up. Um, the Empress uh, could also be your energy down here as well. <clears throat> Doesn't really change the reading that much. Um, but the Page of Pentacles, so 
possibly learning about finances brings great success for you. Uh, so this learning about finances, learning about all of these types of things, even just information coming in regarding that, seems to bring about a lot of um, celebration. Uh, it's like, okay, you know, now that this is starting to happen, I can go forward and I can ask this person to marry me, or I can proceed with this relationship now because I feel of more value that it's a more equal give and take. <clears throat> this could be with Pisces, but at the same time, you don't always see what's going on. And even though this is just sort of starting, it seems like mm, it's been so much work, do I even really want it anymore? Or I can't see what the purpose of all of this is. Do I even really want it anymore? So let's go into the King of Cups. Temperance. Ten of Pentacles. So I get the feeling that for some of you, you're really hoping that, you know, why can this just not materialize? Like, why can I just not have all of this money and all of these things that I want? Um... Temperance is here with the King of Cups saying, hey, you know what? Get in control. Be impatient. Be patient. Because this stuff takes time. This Ten of Pentacles takes time. You have to plant the seeds. It just doesn't sort of come out of thin air. You need to plant the seeds um, so that these things will happen for you. Now, the star is what you need to be aware of. And the star is clarified by the Five of Cups, the World, and the Five of Wands. This is like, you've got your hopes and dreams. But this Five of Pentacles is like, okay, not everything's failed, but I've had three cups spill, and I'm really choked about this. Um, I thought this was going to bring me everything that I wanted, and it's really not. So... It's kind of be aware of that energy of this sort of cynicism going, hey, you know, what? what's the point? I can't have what I want anyway. But we have three cups that are spilt and two that are still right behind you, filled. So it's like... It's like, okay, yeah, something's... Like I lost... I had $20. I lost half of it, I might as well just throw the 10 away. It's kind of the theory is that it's it's kind of feeling like, it's like, well, I, I just should throw it all away. It doesn't make sense because you still have, you know, not all your opportunities are exhausted here. High Priestess, Two of Swords, and the Page of Wands. Um, there's a lot seen here that you don't understand that you can't quite see right now. Um, and that's really got you in your head because you don't have enough information to make a proper decision. But more information is on its way in. You're just going to have to see it and be patient and see it through. Uh, Libra, that's what I have for you today. Best of luck with this week. Uh, I invite you to like, share, subscribe. Even dislike if you don't like this. That's all good. Um, but we'll talk to you next time. Stay safe. Mm-hmm. <clears throat>